Hey guys, what is up? William here with Those Two Dads. I got another awesome Dragon's World vlog coming for you today. So if you saw my last vlog, you saw me make a really good run in the tournament. A nice streak, and uh, that boosts me up to level 368. So we're going to go through here, hopefully get another 6 streak. I'm pretty much out of gems for the tournament, so 6 streaks are really the only thing that I'm going to go for the rest of this tournament. Um, we'll see how I do, how I close out, but... Um, I'm, I would like to hit the 22,000 point range, but I don't think I'm on track for that. Probably a little bit less than that. 5% chance to block an attack for the Ghost Dragon. So this is uh, part 15 of my quest to catch a Unicorn Dragon. If you guys have watched any of my other videos from this series for the week, uh, thanks for checking it out. I hope you guys are enjoying this series. Um, I'll be doing probably at least one of these a month. Um, this is April, so consider this April's, uh, series. Oh, I should have picked my Dragon of Wisdom. I wasn't paying much attention there. You got a Southern Dragon with an Amulet of Ice. Strong attack, 10,000 on that. But he goes down. Alright, we got a Celtic Dragon. I definitely would have been better with my Dragon of Wisdom against the last Dragon, but it is what it is, so... Let's see what my D.O.W. can do with him. Got 10,931 hit points against the Celtic Dragon, and he's going to come back with a 13,157 Brimstone. <clears throat> Alright, but we got the Illusion 8. Takes him out. 10,000 for the win. I would have been pretty sad if that level 20 right off the bat, right at the start of the video, would have blocked an attack and beaten me. That would have been a little depressing. Alright, but we're going to continue on here. We're going to go after this other level 20. Tina, it looked like. Forgive me if I said that name wrong. All right, we got a, a full gin dragon. This is going to be an easier fight. I'm going to do a brimstone 11 7. No armor on the dragon. Got a hypnotic dragon. Maybe I've played this person before. I don't know. Even though it said a strong attack, weak attack only 3,400. It is only a level 10 and in a level 11. A level 11 riddle dragon. No armor, no amulet. This is going to be a strong attack. 17,952 easily takes it down. Black dragon holding down the fort, keeping the others uh, nice and uh, nice and calm. No need to attack for them. Let's move on. We got this uh, level 18 right here we're going to go after. Oh, I was hoping something better than that. Lava dragon. I could have put my Night Dragon in for this fight, but I'm making sure I don't lose. I don't like losing. Unless it's like worth it. If it's like a fight where I'm fighting a higher level, I don't mind losing as much. It's still sad, but it's not as bad as losing to like a level 20, a level 15, something like that. That would be a little depressing. <clears throat> but guys, if you are losing to those lower levels, do not worry. I have been there also. I have lost to a lot of level lower levels before. You've seen all my videos. But before I start, ooh, before I started slowing down, leveling up, where I just stopped trying to level up, just letting the game level me up very, very slowly and gradually through daily rewards and the random dragon that I would breed, um, I was just purposely not leveling up. And that really slowed me down. It really got me farther ahead than the other players who are the same level as me, which makes it uh, better for your points in the tournament. Alright, so we got this level 15 here. We're going to switch out the Black Dragon, put in my Night Dragon, and get him some experience in the tournament. Got a Bright Wing Dragon right off the front. One of my favorites. That dragon is right off from Avatar. Not quite as much off of Avatar as the Jungle Dragon. Uh, the Jungle Dragon is definitely right off of Avatar, though. It even has the little, little things coming off the head to connect to your hair. Like Jake Sully. All right, River Dragon goes down, Night Dragon stays up, and we got a Lava Dragon, level 10. This is going to be an easy fight. 5% chance to block an attack. Let's see if the Lava Dragon can hold some defense. Oh, he does not. The Lava Dragon goes down. 13,000. All right, 51 points for that fight. Now let's continue on and see what we got. A 51, a 34, a 35. I'm definitely going to switch this back around. I'm going to put my Azure Dragon up front, switch some things up a little bit. And let me see who has the fewest amount of points. I got a Spieler at level 35. You'd be weary of the Spieler sometimes. 
So level 39 has 6,000. A level 68 with only 5,100. That's a little scary. You know what? Let's try the Spieler. I've been talking about them this whole tournament. I talk about them every tournament. Let's see what he's got. What is that? A chest dragon? That guy is... That little thing packs a punch. I need to block an attack. Did not block an attack. See, I knew those spielers, those higher level spielers are uh, harder to uh, harder to beat. All right, so he does not block the attack. So I need my uh, black dragon to block an attack to get back into this fight. I am behind one hit. Whoa, double damage. How did that happen? What attack was that? I'm gonna need to go back and see what that attack was. I missed it. I got lost in the 29,000. Um, I've never seen an attack that high, guys. That That is definitely the highest attack I've ever seen. 29,000. And if I can block two attacks, I could be back in this. Does not happen. Well, I'm definitely going to go back on that video and see what that attack was. I have no idea what it was that did 29,000 damage. He didn't have an amulet to... Uh, double his attack. Maybe it was just a random attack that uh, landed double damage, but that definitely messed me up. Spieler, I was right. Stay away from you. I should have taken my own advice, but it was a fun fight nonetheless. Moved on up a little bit, 320. So uh, hopefully we uh, can continue on in uh, the quest to catch a unicorn and keep that rank. I would like to drop below 200. I don't know if that will happen or not. Um, but at least be under the 300 range would be cool. My best tournament rank ever is 288, I believe it is. So I'm trying to beat that. We'll see what happens. Guys, if you like my videos, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel. Those two dads, we appreciate it.